Um, uh, let's see here. We are... <clears throat> Just to wrap up, review really quickly the last... Half of last stream or so. Um, we found and killed the third demigod. Radon. Who was wearing this armor. And upon doing so... His hold on a meteor in space <laughs> crash landed uh, into the Forgotten Lands and opened up a path to the Eternal City, which we then traversed and fought some bosses. And uh, made our way here to this underground wood. And I'm going to actually backtrack really quickly. Ha! Really quickly. We'll see how, how quickly exactly. But I want to... Uh, go back to a potential boss fight that we may have skipped. Yeah, quickly? I don't know. I mean, we'll see. <clears throat> We're back at the Eternal City. There's one more fire that I need to light somewhere. Somewhere here. Actually, did I ever continue? Man, there's quite a bit. I didn't continue down to, to where second large dead man is either, did I? Holy cow. Okay. Wait, what? Alright. Let's see. Horse denied. Yeah, it's very easy to get derailed. And then not return. Oh, we gotta go this way. No camera, dude! <sighs> That's that turn in the corner on the way to Anorlando Archers, man. It's same thing. But I thought they fixed that. They fixed that in Dark Souls Remastered. <clears throat> oh. This has been a good start. This has been a great start. Welcome back. We'll count those two gravity deaths as one because... I'm just kidding. You can count as many as you want. That's why I jumped there, because I thought we were at that ledge. Wrong! Alright, let's go. Knight's Sacred Ground. Uh-huh. I see something. Wait, what? Oh. That's a torch. Never mind. Gravity's the only foe that can give you a proper warm-up. Yes. Wait. I think I died. Yeah, and then I didn't continue. The naked ladies. attack faster than me. That's why I got killed before. Uh, huh? Hmm. Curious. Hello? Clear? This reminds me of Amalrot from Final Fantasy XIV. Hello? I see it's shiny. No. Just a shine coming off the steeple. City is aesthetically pleasing. Space. Purples, pinks, 
There he is. There's the other big guy. Butterflies. Nascent butterfly. Imagine doing crafting. <laughs> That's going to have to be a whole thing to explore later. It's like... I'm sure there are some things uh, very worth crafting. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Hey, Historical Knight. Can't wait for the challenge runs. Same? Like, same? Ooh, I have to do my Margit Guide video uh, today, pretty much. So I don't know if I'll do that on stream or off. But we can at least practice on stream. Black Wet Blade. I can do the learning on stream. Well, yeah, I mean, I can do the fight recording off stream as well. I just... Because the, the actual fighting and then the... Uh, me commentating over the fight will be separate, right? Grants choice of affinity upgrade to weapon. When applying an affinity using physical or occult type ashes of war, an additional affinity of poison blood or occult can be cho chosen. Now, see that... I feel like I'm missing out on that. Oh, you son of a bitch. This is a... They made these easier, I think. They're easier than crystal lizards. They're more forgiving. Um, This fog gate is white? Oh no, it's not. A, that's why it's white. It's a sword stone key place. Yes, I will make a new character to, to refight Margit. Oh. Sorry. I thought you were a friend. Why'd you do that? Oh? Mimic Tear Ashes. Legendary Ashen Remains. Used to summon the spirit of a Mimic Tear, summoning consumes HP rather than FP. This spirit takes the form of the Summoner to fight alongside them, but its mimicry does not extend to imitating the Summoner's will. Mimic Tears are the result of an attempt by the Eternal City to forge a Lord. Can't summon here. Can't summon here, though. Yeah, interesting. I like it. I don't have much FP, so that's perfect for me. Um, we'll see what it means by the other stuff. Uh, yeah, a clone of yourself that auto fights you. Yeah. I think they're just saying it doesn't do exactly what you do. It just it does its own thing. Basically, the boss fight that we had. Spoilers. Oh no. Kind of. That's some thick level verticality. Deskend. One second. Let me reload this thing. There we go. Oh. Nice. Don't you think you're missing a lot by not using magic faith fire? Uh if I was missing a lot not using magic, then I would be missing a lot of melee. If I, if I used a bunch of magic, I'd miss a lot of melee. And if I used a lot of magic, I'd miss a lot of pyromancy. And if I lose a lot of pyromancy, I'd miss a lot of blah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be playing this game about 700 times, so there's plenty of other playthroughs to use. What the f Who's 
controlling this shit? Get off my ass! Right. Respec item. Huh. <laughs> Interesting. That's an enemy. I don't know about the one that, like, they summon that rolls into you. I think we might be at ground level with giant dead man. Yes. I see him. I've seen your kind. Time and time again. What are these gonna mimic into? I don't like this. I don't. Oh! Really? I can't one shot? Hold on. What? What? Oh. Celestial do. What? Shit, both of us did it. Dang, I wanna... Oh shit. Oh, hello. You can't be faster than me, right? <laughs> Except when I have to recover. Don't heal. Ow! Fuck. There you go. Nice. Uh. Exclamation point build. Build is in the title. Great sword. <laughs> That's it. Strength, great sword. Suck. Ooh. Strength, big sword. Mm-hmm. Ah, soft cotton. Cannot horse. Phalanx too. Uh oh. Is that gonna, gonna be the boss? That's cheating, that's... Come here. Ow. Dagger, please. Ha! Ah. Oh, he's got his weapon. I see. Yes. Yes, he do. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Oh, okay.
Wow, you pulled your leg up. Ah. Ah. I just want him to stagger, but it's not gonna happen, is it? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Guys, you go to a dermatologist. Yeah. <laughs> huh? Oh. Pathetic sort ahead. Silver tear husk. And the droppies. Were those R2 attacks? Me? I didn't use an R2. Did you see the new Pokemon trailer slash starters? No. I did not. I got cool armor. Thank you. Oh. A teleport? No, oh, I, I, I would prefer no hints for now. What's up, Shadow Fox? How's it going? Elder Ring. Hmm. Finger Slayer Blade. And Great Ghost Glove Wart. Are we gonna kill the two fingers? It's a key item. Hidden treasure of the eternal city of Nakron. The hidden treasure of the eternal city of Nakron, a blade said to have been born of a corpse. This blood drenched fetish is proof of the high treason committed by the eternal city and symbolizes its downfall. It cannot be wielded by those without a fate, but it's said to be able to harm the greater will and its vassals. Oops. Well, I didn't mean to rest, but... Let's see here. I can't put anything on this greatsword, man. That kind of stinks. Kind of stinks. I'm definitely missing out from... Oops. Not using a weapon that I can slap Ashes of War onto. Hello, Weather Kane. How you doing? What, let's see, what, what other options could I have? We can swap weapons. Uh, we could do a regular greatsword. There is always that. And we could have, let's see, storm stomp, determination. Um. Determination give you poise? Is that, is that what that one is? Hold the flat arrow into your flaming pleasure zone, powering up your next attack. Just tumble buff. You can put an Ashes of War on your katana to make it quality scaling, but you lose the katana R2, which seems bad. Interesting. Uh, hold on. How does the damage change? Oops. Does it actually make the scaling better? Oops. No, it actually just makes it worse. But I have this thing where we can add an affinity, right? Standard. Oh, I see. Oh, oh, yeah. Okay. Huh. Interesting. Okay, so that's not... I get it. I get it. I hadn't done this before, so I didn't realize that that's just how you infuse. 
Uh, there's no, there's no strong, no heavy infusion that I have found yet. It would seem. So, uh... But hey, let's do this, and then, uh... Let's go upgrade the thing? I mean, I used Art of Wars, but... As far as the affinity stuff, yeah. I didn't mess around with it because I couldn't put any on my great sword, so... <clears throat> yeah, it's just that... This, the weapon style I've chosen is less... Open to all, all these Ash of War mechanics. Any updates here? Greetings. Are you here for... What was that that I should know Greetings about the spirit. the I Invader Man, right? Howling and wailing of... You should keep your... I know you're... Sh I know you're strong. Well, where have you been? I took you for no matter. Lay out your arm. Where is the lady we fed the the potion? Strength and armament. Well, okay, okay, fine. We'll do that. We'll do that. We just need seven. Wow, that's a lot to level up this bad boy. Ooh. No. Wait, what? Smithing stone four. Plus 11? I'm out of smithing stones now. 268 plus 131. Okay, it's still worse right now. Max is 25. That's awesome. Holy shit. <laughs> uh, that's a great idea. I love that. I did beat the third great rune boss yesterday. Uh. Huh. Oi. Oh, I can't change my handedness. That's right. Thanks, Moosh. I seem like I expect to be way higher level when you finish this in any previous game. I mean, it's a much bigger game, so that makes sense. I am pleased. Would you like me? the blessing? Is would you like to be? Where is? Where is? <sighs> Journey to the capital. I know, yeah, but where's your daughter? I don't know where she is. Do you guys know where she, where um, ne Nefeli is? The blessing is an item you can use that gives you poise. It reduces H HP. Oh wait, just carrying it reduces HP. That makes sense. Get the fuck out of here. Oh, no. That didn't fix me. At the glory hole. 5% is huge, kind of. She's waiting out in the world, but I, like, drugged her. I have to wait, as in, like, I need to progress further. It goes away when the buff from the blessing runs out. Oh, there you go. There it is. Eh, it's not the biggest loss. <laughs> Ripped my base 1,000 even HP. 
Yeah, the whole playthrough I've had that, pretty much. <laughs> Hello. How are you doing? Uh-oh. Is this because I've done enough death rot turn-ins or whatever? Time to respect to get 1k flat. I could just take a hug again. Um... She over here by chance? There she is! I'm just kidding. <laughs> Not quite. This is first playthrough, yes. Okay, let's go back. Right. We are searching for one more fire. He said he's gonna die soon, last convo. Oh shit, I forgot about that. Uh, you were waiting for something to come of the debuff? I mean, there could be, uh, you know, like a quest with her. If I actually went through and killed these guys, it would probably be easier to find, because all I've done is run around. Let's just did most of the job, but... Always a singing character. I like it. Well, almost always. Hello. Um, but this is where the thing is. That doesn't mean there can't be a fire here to light. Well. Uh. Steps over there. Maybe in the lower steps. I got this one. This music gives you Zelda dungeon vibes. The singing part, or like, oh yeah, no, no, you're right, you're right, yeah, totally, absolutely. This kind of, I don't know, wood flute thing. Uh, she ad-libbed. There's not one on the beach, is there? I got this one near the fox. There's not... Did I miss one by the baby that we got? Surely not, right? Hmm. Felsey watching you beat the shit out of Redon last night. Good shit. Nice. Nice. top part of that. The notebook. God! Dude! The 180 is the safest way to turn on the horse.
Hello. I didn't miss a lady thingy, did I? Did I? Do you guys know where the light thing is? I think I need the light. I'll take guidance to it at this point. I've run around this place several times. Maybe it's early and I, I didn't backtrack early. What's up, Velga? What's up? Uh, Brianna Elt. How you doing? Where's it at, Proxy? It's by the steps. Underneath a really big stone pillar. Oops. Let me head back. Leading to the boss. To the... Oh. Leading to the... Ancient antler boss. Produce the symbol of the king. Son of a bitch. Okay. Underneath the big pillar. On the way to the boss. Under steps. To the right of the stairs. <laughs> Here? I might be going too fast. To the right of the stairs. For more to the right. Down there. Oi! Oh shit! Oh shit! Look, I'll tell you what. Aha! Shit! Fuck my boys, man. Can be bad. One of them. Holy roll catch. Uh, towards the bridge from here. I was looking to the right of the stairs. I don't even see one that I already lit. There we go. That's what I want to see. Smush. Other side. Did I go near it? Towards the bridge from there. Oh, God. Stop! Stop! Stop it. Stop! Oh, my God. He's gonna... Is that it? Oh, I didn't get that shit. Yeah, it was near the beginning. Fuck. Okay. Yeah. Oh, it's not just you, Anubis. Not just you. All right. Thank you, guys. You need to allow your game to access your computer to make you want them to stop. No, it's already doing that, and they're... Oh, you mean so they hear that I tell them to stop? That makes sense. I thought they were hearing me yell, and they were they kept chasing me. All right, let's see a tough version of you, shall we? Spirit Moose. Regal Ancestor Spirit. I can use Mimics here. How much health? Holy health usage! Look, it's me. There you go. Oh, wait. Oh, you did that before. The music, man.
have like four keys? No, 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 no. Oh. Ooh. Nice. Give me that head, bro. No. Don't let it heal. Don't let it heal. Oh, nice. Well. <laughs> died kind of fast. I get it, though. That's cool. Uh, so, um... It just does an AoE at some point and heals off the damage it deals. I think it healed off of my fucking Mimic tier, dude. Remembrance of the Regal Ancestor. What? Dude, the, the fight's gorgeous. Those guys were harder because they have such good music. I know, right? Like... Don't worry, challenge runs. Soul level one. <laughs> this is the second fight with it, Theoves. If you did the first one, that was one. This is the second fight. The power of its name taking me locks. Ancestral spirits exist as a phenomenon beyond the purview of the Erd tree. Life sprouts from death as it does from birth. Such is the way of the living. Soul level one is the next playthrough. Hopefully, there's nothing else here, right? I don't think there's anything else. Oh, that's a gorgeous fight. Man. I really get heavy, like, Sekiro vibes there. Can the Mimic Summon kill you on cast? <laughs> My guess is you'll just scratch your ass. Oops. Great Waterfall Basin. Okay. Do you guys want to continue... Through the trees? Or do you want to go back to Altus Plateau? Wait, this is... Oh, this is the boss. Right. Yeah, I should see what we can craft with the... Antlerman stuff. Trees? Alright, we'll trees. We'll trees it. What's that, Altus? There was a fucking badass dragon that we were beating up, but then it ran away. Um, there are giants. The path from Altus leads to Landell, which is, I think, a city at the base of the Erd Tree or something. Have you seen Wolfman after Radon boss? You can't find him anymore. No, I don't think so. <sighs> Winged Great Horn. Strength Dex. A unique horn in which the power of ancestral spirits fiercely dwells. This large wing shaped specimen is wielded as a weapon of spirit worship. In the ancestral spirit worshiping faith, these are considered on envoys' wings made to reap the lives of beings which experience no sprouting. Unique skill Soul Stifler. Raise the Great Horn's wings to summon a soul-sapping miasma. Like Nita. Enemies in the affected area will temporarily suffer from reduced defense. Support weapon? If it works on bosses, that'd be cool. 
I mean, cool. This is. <clears throat> oh, that's huge. Item cut from the horns of the regal ancestor spirit. Restore FP upon defeating enemies. A number of new growths bud from the antler-like horns of the fallen king, each glowing with light. Thus does new life grow from death, and from death one obtains power. Wow. That's nutty. Wait, can you... Uh... Hey, Radon Spear. Oh, great arrow. Okay. Fucking crown. Um. How do you duplicate those? Is that. You duplicate at the four legged things, or is that duplicating something else? You can duplicate Ashes of War at the blacksmith, right? And I think you duplicate souls at the four. Yeah, the bell turtle. <laughs> yeah, bell turtle. Okay. So you got limited dupes, potentially. I don't know how many there are in the game, but... Must not recover a lot of FP. I mean, even some is better than none. And especially, like... Like, it might not... It's not going to carry a sorcerer build, I feel like. But, for me, using the... Weapon art, occasionally. To give me stats and poise. And then clearing through stuff. He is tough, demonized. Uh... There are a bunch of things you can summon in the arena if you want help getting through it. Like, they're NPCs. I think that's kind of the intended way to get through the fight. Um, I mean, you could just... I think they were like, yeah, this dude's fucking hard, so let's just throw a bunch of NPCs down. And make it a big... a big battle, right? Super epic. Uh, okay. How hard does plus 12 greatsword hit? Still like, there's like 80 damage less than my plus six grafted blade greatsword. 293 plus 226. 268 plus 170. Damn. It's got better guard though. It's also heavier than the Grafted Blade Greatsword. Yeah. It's heavier, it's got better guard. It's more solid metal. Okay, we killed an Erd Tree avatar right here, and we got their awesome little... I see a thing up there. We got their awesome uh, staff mace. Ugly. I see great. No, it's not Grace. Ah. Ants. But also dung. Are you kidding me? Just kill it, please. Thank you. Oh my god. Ash of War Golden Land? Ew! No, oh no! Help you! Don't! Jesus! Roll it! Roll it! Roll me! Okay. One, two, three. What the? Oh, the head doesn't take any damage. Okay. Got it. Fuck! Was that through my block? These ants suck ass! What is this, Texas? There you go. Stoopy doopy. Whoa! God. I didn't know ants could do that. Jump at me. Do it. Yeah. 
Ah, no, I'm in. Shit. That's a uh, clam. All right, nice. Huh. Formic rock, great. Now let's go back and look at this badass thing. What was this? <clears throat> Golden land. Colossal weapons. This Ash of War grants an armament to the an armament this armament the sacred affinity in the following skill. Thrust armament into the ground, then gather strength to unleash a blast of sacred energy that coalesces into golden darts. Follow up with the strong attacks to swing the armament and sweeping strike. Your mom is colossal. So let her live her life. Was this a side thing? Maybe this was side stuff. Well, if I don't have to kill them again, then I'll go sit at the... At De Grace. At De Grassi. I want to see this ash used too. It's, it's the ability that the Erd Tree avatars have, right? Where they slam down. It's like a spherical AoE. And then it spawns like the, the homing soul mass type things. I'm pretty sure. I can't put anything on this damn sword. That's a lot of holy damage. Faith. Ugh. Ugh. Split damage too, though. It's the only thing. <sighs> It's got the follow-up too. What what type of attack did it say? Just any attack? Maybe a right trigger. Uh, whoops. Uh, uh, mm, mm. Can I not see it because it's equipped? I guess it's on the sword itself. <laughs> Golden land. Follow up with a strong attack. Nice. More of Dragon Slayer size Golden Age sword. It's pretty. <laughs> Trusty great sword. Hmm. It just I uh I just have a hard time swapping when it's just when it's objectively worth right now that's i mean there's so much of my playthrough that i don't care about being op optimal i have trouble getting away from weapons that i you know, i've invested a lot into and are better currently if we find enough upgrade materials and it surpasses the damage or equates to the damage i uh, hap happily I will swap to that. Why not power stance then? I like wearing armor. At least for a first playthrough. I'm going to do so many playthroughs where I'm just naked and fast rolling. And then... We're going to have all sorts of crazy heavy builds and stuff. Shoy! Smithing stone six. <gasps> Kit! <clears throat> yeah, it's a big damage decrease to take, unfortunately. Even without swapping it wholly. I mean, if I took it wholly, I think the numbers look better, but split damage, you know. 
And who knows what holy is going to be effective against necessarily. Will Torrent be naked too? Sure, I'll get the massive horse dong mod and we'll be in good shape. Is there an item behind? Nice. Oh, flying... Fuck. Do I need to get up on this? Wait. Oh. Smithing stone four. I think that is what I was missing. For the upgrade, but I think I needed a couple more. Oh. Uh -oh. That's a... Uh, so, I think the orange tinge is a weapon, isn't it? Because I noticed the tinge difference. I see that item over there, but right now I'm just gonna, um... Kind of book. Oh, God! I didn't do an initial jump! Oh, now I can jump. What? The ants and the spider hands. Yeah, the spider hands, yeah. You thought color was rarity? Well, I mean, an item that's on the ground has no rarity because it's always there, right? Is that a grace? No, that's my souls probably. Sorry, my runes. <laughs> you see that message on the branch there? <laughs> Don't mind me. Oh! <laughs> Message help. Perfect. Uh, Cole from Space, Icy, Baron, King of Matthews, Lesputnik. All resubbers and subbers. Thank you guys very much. It's the horse, dudes. This horse control is... It's nice and fast. But it's also all over the place. Whee! Whee! Well, it can't be as bad as the ants that were outside, right? Oh, I'm gonna pop that sucker. Whee! Splash! What was on this side of it? Newman's rune! That's a big boy rune. Wait. I mean, do they all drop Newman's runes? Gotta pop them all. Ant asshole. What? That's not, a, that's not an ant asshole. But why would you say that? 
I see many ants on the ceiling. All right, we're gonna do this. We're gonna pop this. And we're gonna freaking go! A rune arc each? Oh my god, my equipment! I can't clear the screen fast enough. Hi. I have poise! I pressed the poise button. I'm gonna fucking blow up and do an ant shit. Don't. Don't! <laughs> Move up, move up on them. I'm in Florida. Lobos, you must mate with the queens and rule the colony. Well, I think they won't be spawned now, maybe. Or maybe they just won't drop their sweet, sweet loot. One of the twos. I did, I pressed the poise button. Left trigger, baby. Now hold on, do I have a cat? Cat ring on? No, I actually have boost physical damage negation on. I will switch out a HP max for poise. <laughs> Wolf ring. Damn it, we need seven. Ah. Seven. Here it is. Weapon. Ah, it's a spell. Elden Stars. Dude, I can't wait to do a paladin build in this game. I had a six, but I need we need a seven, and then we can close the gap with eight and nine. Get the fart out of here, Ant. Get get out. I want to look at my Elden Stars. Stars. I like how they separated. Wait. They separated. Oh, these are incantations. Oh. S creates a stream of golden shooting stars that assail the area. Legendary Incantation is the most ancient of those that derive from the Erd Tree. It is said that long ago the Greater Will sent a golden star bearing a beast into the lands between, which would later become the Elden Ring. The beast or the star? Or both? A golden star bearing a beast. Oh, like it has a beast emblem or actually a beast well we're gonna fight that beast we better <laughs> we're gonna go inside the elden ring just like we go inside the eternal ring this is a sequel after all Really? No ants crawling from all over the log? Dukist Herba. Try behind. Just turn around is what you're saying, okay. I 
I found stone six, but we need stone seven. We have eight and nine. All we need is seven now. I did upgrade, so it is plus six. If we find stone uh, somber plus seven, then we'll get seven, eight, and nine immediately. And that's huge damage upgrade on the special weapons. Give me one seven seven seven. Get fart. Get off my goddamn horse. Oh my god. Let me get it. Oh no no no. Heal heal heal. Run. Flee flee flee. Yes, re resummon steed. Get out of here, you stupid bee ass. It's another finger lady. Oh, and one of these. Nice. Why do you need a specific somber stone instead of just a number of them? The number indicates the quality of the stone. It's like... It's like um, cold blood dew in Bloodborne. should have died a true death. As the first of the demigods to die. As a martyr to destined death. But why must it yet bring such disgrace? A scion of the Golden Bow, sentenced to live in death. Just resurrect him and I'll kill him. How could such a thing come to be? Oh. Don't you want to see my pe my fingers? Oh, my oh, okay, all right. Oh, okay, stop that. like the boss's area maybe i don't know he that would be cool they said of the golden they say of the golden tree it's a pretty golden area i'm yeah there's more bees over here yeah why? What do you guard? Guard dang. No, this is my first playthrough still. <laughs> uh, we are 43 hours into my first playthrough. Very dense area. What's this glorious hat? Hey, there's a basilisk. Uh oh. Death, death blight. Let's see it. Uh. Oh, they their eyes are different now. Are those now their actual eyes? <laughs> they look like ET. What the fuck?
I don't know why I'm on my horseback still. Let's get off. Come here! There you go. <laughs> yeah, they got ETIs, man. Oh, what's up? I think those are... I think those might be their actual eyes this time. Miyazaki was like, look. Everybody found out my secret, so I'm not doing it anymore. I don't see your small eyes. Huh? Oh. More of them. Well... This forest is terrifying. <laughs> the fuck? This forest blows ass. I can't see shit. There's death blight. There's fire breathing giants. Golden centipedes. It looks like a tree thing, kind of. Wait, what did they drop? He dropped. No. Don't do that. Nice. Stop it. Dropped something, one of them. Oh no. This is just acquire materials. Oh. I thought I saw a pick up item. Mm. Is that milk? Oh the water, yeah. <laughs> Definitely milk. Ew! What? Tree man. He's wearing undies. It's like the gargoyles from yesterday? Oh. Is it? Hey, stop. Uh, all right, I'm tired of this death blit white shit. Death blit. All right. We've come uh, come back around here. Death bleh. 
Where am I on the map? Underground and really far north. Uh, this is after you kill the third demigod. Well, I guess not necessarily the third. Uh, you could probably do this without clearing out the academy. I'll tell you the maps are nearly the same size. What, the underground? Uh, I don't think it's nearly the same amount of stuff, but there are areas, right? This is all I've seen underground, personally. And then this is above ground, but yeah, it's a lot of stuff. I've not been invaded by a player, no. Only NPC. Can't hit shit! Oh my god! Stagger. Thank you. It's even locks! Dry the ring, avoiding spoilers for now. Fair enough. Found found Renala and she's slapping you. She, uh, she's cool. She cool, man. The fuck? Is that just a dead gargoyle, man? Oh yeah, there's his head. Ew. What's up, Grantlebart? Uh... Ah, oh, shit. Vacuum slice. <clears throat> no colossal. Vacuum slice, lost skill of ancient heroes. Hold the armament aloft to surround it with a shearing vacuum, then launch it forward as a blade like projectile, usable on swords and axes. Storm ruler? Does it clean the carpet after killing the enemy? That would be great. That would be very handy. Mm, yes, these knights. I saw one patrolling on horseback. They concern me. Ew! I see one up there. There's the knight on horseback. I guess it's better than a knight on than a horse on night back though.
What are you doing? Shit. All right, let's just fight normal. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Go. Yeah, he's headless. We've seen some headless enemies here and there. There's a lot down to explore. Hmm. And evil, evil nightmen there. I don't know why evil. Maybe there's a checkpoint though. You get this armor from purchasing. Have you killed the, have you killed the demigod that looks like this, Adarsh? A bellboy. Human Bone Shard. So you can purchase armor of downed bosses from the Finger Reader in the hub. Um, some movie does before bigger fights and glows green. Are you talking about the Hulk? Golden runes. And some butterfly. Golden runes. You want, you're curious to my location. Uh, I'm up here. Like underneath the Ur tree, I feel like. So I think we're gonna come up into Lanedell. Oh shit, really? See where it takes us. Is it gonna laser beam down? Maybe it takes us into a spot that we couldn't have accessed before. Unless it goes up again. Oh, it's definitely going down. Oh, shit! Dead. Well, we came from uh, a coffin, and the co the coffin was magically lifted up by a holy string of text. But now we've gone back down. Oh. What the fuck? Where are we? Let's see where we're at. Ainsel River, Maine. Ah. Okay, okay. Nice. This is where the, all the ants were and where we found the dragonkin boss fight. But it's a... There's a heckin' grace point, so it's... Maybe there's just a boss. That would be cool. This is a different coffin. Mm-hmm. Oh. Oh, I can't. Oh, uh, there's a co-op thingy. Oh, it's that thing! Or it's one of those. Oh, Jesus. All right, okay. Ool Palace Ruins. But we're like up, upper side or something. Am 
We have to a actually get to fight one of these. It's kind of exciting. We only got to see it before. Cool, human bone shards, cool. Nice, nice timing. Sorry, Spearman. God, they roll in. No, stop it. Stop it. Don't throw things. You're throwing things. No, 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 no. Oh, God, I stepped out. Run. Heal. Oops. I'm not, oh, I did reach. Seven and eight and nine coming up. What are these bubbles? Don't bubble me. Mega worth it. Absolutely. 
Oh yeah, these guys melt. I forgot. Uh, what could I explore now that it's dead and not endangering me? Ghost Glove Wart 6. There's a flower over there. Squirtle use Bubble Beam. Just follow your nose. Hmm. The stupid poisoning. Although that one may rot. That one may cause rot. What are these? I can't loot them? Oh, there we go. I had to be up. Uh-oh. Oh, I don't like that. Oh, it's just these. Okay. What is yellow? Yellow's got to be death blight. Paula, no, that is death blight. Holy shit. Stone sword key, stone sword key. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Come on then. Stop spewing. Mimic peer, tear. Probably doesn't care about... Oh, God. Death Blight, right? This flower not stagger? There it goes. Yes. Ugh, that's it. Oh yes, just there we go. Nice. You can summon yourself. Yeah. Clayman Ashes. Is Did my dude die? If my dude died to uh, gravity, then that is just poetic. I feel like. The mimic to your ash is in the eternal city. If that doesn't help, it's gotta keep going. Would you recommend Liurnia or Kaelid after Limgrave in terms of difficulty? Liurnia! 100%. That's where I went first, basically. <laughs> lift up to his progeny. Sad. Yeah, I really didn't do a, hardly any limb grave. I followed the story beats straight to the castle. Went to Liurnia. Then backtracked at some point. I would even did some Kaelid before a limb grave, I think. Ugh. Of course there are ants. Formic Rock at least. I think Formic Rock is for the stronger uh, firebomb that you can craft. If an invisible... I mean, if a magical boulder suddenly shows up... Oh, they're going to put me to sleep? Is that what's going to happen?
I want to go home. Yeah. Uh, Shield grease, huh? Oh, it's one of those ants, too. Ew. It's got like a... No, that's, that's all his. The big ants suck. Okay, alright, alright. Let's go. on big head mode and big ass mode. Oh, I would love to turn those modes on. Oh, this is above the other place. This is one of those tough boys? Hmm. No. Oh, shit! Uh oh. Never mind. Oh my god! Fucking Lido! Come on, Gravity Man's knock it off. I thought he was controlling the... That thing. Gravity Stone Fan! Sekiro? Wait. Oh, is that actually a weapon? I accidentally closed it way too quickly. Is it a weapon? It's an oh, it's a consumable, a reusable. <clears throat> it was purple, wasn't it? Gravity. Oh, I'm in keys. <laughs> Tools. There it is. Use FP to emit fan-shaped gravitational shock wave. C strength. B int. Shard of Rock found in the wake of a meteorite strike. It is imbued with a particularly weighty magic. The desperate ones who scavenge for those shards dub themselves Star Callers. chest wing of astel curved sword magic 
Sword fashioned from a delicate wing suffused with the magic of the stars. Strong attack unleashes a wave of enchanted light. Crafted from a relic of the natural born of the void. Who is said to have assailed the eternal city. Unique skill, Nebula. Imbue the natural born's wings with magic to send forth a dark cloud of stars that lingers briefly before exploding. Enough stats. That's pretty cool. Pretty cool. That's where I currently am, Noxie Bray. Ainsel River, but by way of. Here we go. Upper. To get that item, right? Yeah. In a secondary part of Ainsel River. Oh shit. You need to do a spell sword build. There are a lot of options for int. Golden Rune Tin. I'm Oom. No, well. It's not that, it's that I don't have this. If you don't have the stats for the weapon, you can't use the weapon art properly. Brother, what? Is that a heckin' Anor Londo? Again. Yeah. Noxtella Eternal City. As opposed to Nokron, the Eternal City. This is a different city. There are pyroscales, spells, and hexes, hexes in this game. Yes. There's another Eternal City. Uh, but first... We already did find the Dragon King, Dragonkin soldier, yes. I mean, I'm not gonna remember all the names. There's so many names. I remembered him as Dragonkin, not of Noxtella, but good to know. Well, I took you no matter. It's all day out your own. Cool. Like a uh, hundred extra damage. No problem. Somber Ancient Dragon Smithing Stone. Over 100 extra damage, I feel like. We were like 280 and then 220 scaling. So, yeah, like 130 more damage. Um, oh, we went to B scaling and strength as well. Looks like dragons back on the menu. I would love to kill that dragon that ran away from me. I'm sure he'll be back. There was two of them that ran away from me. Wait a minute. Ah, yes. Uh, there you go. Yep, Dragonkin Soldier of Noxtella and Noxtella Eternal City. Ooh, leveling Mimic is actually a good idea, too. Sure, I'll do that. I can actually use it since it doesn't cost FP.
Game's pretty dang cool. Good on this little indie upstart studio. Greetings. Are you here for spin? This thing's gonna get strong, ain't it? What? There's now a talk option after upgrading. I feel like I'm really coming to grips with spirit tuning of late. I can see how and why immortal essence exists. A spirit under the golden order. I can understand their yearnings. What they become drawn to. Master Hugh said it himself, actually. That I'm no mere apprentice any longer. Once again, I'm pleased to make your acquaintance. Moderica, the certified spirit tuner. Curtsy! <laughs> nice. No, it's that you have to upgrade a certain distance, Spaz. I didn't even have a talk option until I just now upgraded my spirit uh, thingy far enough. The only option I had were spirit tuning or there's something you should know, which is her telling us about the, um, the invader man off in the other location. So you have to upgrade to a certain amount, like a certain level before that unlocks. You have a plus seven jelly and you don't have that option. Well, that's a good question then. But that was the cl that was something that just happened, right? I opened the menu. There was no talk option. I upgraded. There was a talk option. Uh, do they not work here? Zach and Toke, did you raid? I don't have any sort of alerts on for the entirety of Elden Ring. I don't even normally have raid alerts though. Do your weapon buffs remain if you switch weapons after? No. Well, I mean, not for all the rest of the Soulsborne Kiro games. So I would imagine not. This dude's riding an ant. Where would you rate this in the Souls game so far? Uh, getting pretty dang close to best. Oof, fuss. Radon is a rough boy, that's for sure. Thank you for the raid! Sorry I missed that. We are Radon now, so. Am I staying level 75? Nope. Nope. We in on Courage. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, you're doing the graphic greatsword as well? I love it. I just, we just got it to plus nine. After waiting so long for plus six and plus seven somber stones. Yoink. Nox Monk Hood. Is that a Tenetris you got there? It's a bendy one. Yep, now I just found a plus seven. Uh, the area that I found it, however, was post Radon. Unless. Well, yeah, I'm not sure. I believe plus 10 is the max, yes. For this weapon. Apparently, regular weapons go up to plus 25. Silver Tear Husk. Post Radon, yeah. Yep. The ratting in this game will be crazy. There's a lot of options. Ugh. 
I saw a um, white fog gate up there. So a stone sword key door, I believe. <clears throat> Is that a snail? Is it a snail? It's just a snail. I don't want to kill cute snail. Oh. I don't want to get killed by cute snail either. It has a very sharp tongue. Okay. It's a snail. Electra jellies. Serpent arrow. Hmm. Any tips on killing Godric? Um. If you go and watch my fight with Godric, I'm literally like calling out all of my thought process while doing it. That's honestly the best way to get a tip on Godric. I the whole time I'm fighting him, I'm reading his combos and going, you know, swipe, swipe, dodge, attack, dodge, attack. I was doing that the whole time, pretty much. How do you get to this area? It's, that's a loaded question. Have you beaten Radon for starters? Watch your Godric kill and actually one shot with Bloodhound's Fang. If you've beaten Radon, spoilers imminent in what I'm about to say. If you do not want post Radon spoilers, okay. <clears throat> After beating Radon. The meteorite falls, right? And you can access the Eternal City over here. You go through there, you go up, you find the place where you can fight the harder version of the ancient spirit. You fight the gargoyles. Oh god. Go past the gargoyles into the tree area. Uh, and then from the tree area, you can take a coffin down into this area. Yeah, more map open than I do. Really? Oops. Well, so I could have gone here and uh, this was a very long time ago that we reached this place. But I kind of keep asking and just instead of going there, we've been going continuing this way. Oh, God. Um. Ah. Also, super fun. That's where I found shards eight and nine. I think that's where I found them too. That's. That's kind of like, I guess the main reason I haven't gone back is I was like, oh, this is later, later game stuff, but they kill each other. <laughs> the chain reaction. Stop. That's nice. Spoilers can be done now. Oh, God. Destroyed. 
Oh my god, there is a repulse on the ground. Holy shit. That's baller. Alright, so you need to group up all the electric jellies. Oh, there's only two here. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Wait, what? That one died really easily. Oh, it's got a freaking failing shield, I just noticed. Oh, that's cool. Absolutely, I'm sure people have beaten the game on Twitch. If you uh, if you do less side stuff, you could beat the game easily by how how long we've spent in here. Nice. Did you find the wolf Lobo in the game? Nope. Uh. Well, oh my god. Yeah, that works. It's not a boss soul weapon, no. Drops uh, in the very southern, southwest most point on the above ground map. The furthest south point, really. Yeah, ported to Landell on some altar with an elevator shaft you could use. You can't pour it out as soon as you die, I could pour it. Uh, I got to the... You're talking about the Divine... Oopsies. Divine Bridge? I went there. Which I believe to be Lane Dell, since they said it was at the base of the Erd Tree, which seems to be that. Um, but I haven't gotten any progress from that. Turtle Pope takes a lot of books, yeah. I gave so many books to Turtle Pope, holy shit. There's a uh, golden seed. Cannot horse. Teleport to trap, stop you from using map teleport until you rest at a grace. Oh, really? Interesting. Oh, that's not from here, though. We have to bridge across? But there's stuff over here anyways. Oh my gosh, that was amazing. Sir. Plenty of worm and rock. Mm. Waypoint ruins is right. Um, oh, it's up here. Waypoint ruins. <clears throat> I'm familiar with that one because that's where I had to keep going in order to go to certain places so it's kind of a common travel point well at least based on my discovery it was pretty common you don't think you've even been there oh <clears throat> now to the east of that lake there that charred lake. Any big plans for St. Jude this year? We'll raise a bunch of money. Probably play a ton of Elden Ring. It's a common point for you to go to. You're going there a few, few times to fight some Black Knight boss fights. Black Knight boss fights. Whoa. 
What is all this on the ground? Ah, oh, shit. Bro, I'm gonna use you against the freaking Ant Knight. How about that? Come on, Ant Knight. Do it. Nice. Ow. Oh my god. Why don't you use any of the rune arcs and great runes? They make you a lot stronger. Well, I'm saving them until I beat the game and then never use them. I'm waiting something for where where I clearly just need that extra boost, but I don't think that's going to happen really. <clears throat> I mean, that's how you play. Any sort of RPG, right? In the game with seven max elixirs, it. You use entirely on the final boss, and then it's just a cheese fest. What? Did that. Okay, hold on. What? Oh, shit, shit, shit. Forgot. I was too focused on the dung. Oh, okay. Why? Have fun! That's great. Celestial do. Oh! That was close. Oh no, not big head ones. But why are you here? If not... I can't mimic here. Can I just kill it? Yeah! Oh my god. Hit it in the butt. 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 Baby in the butt. Slap! Whoa. Oh, I was out of steam. Don't! Don't you dare. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> well. Is my lantern on? No. Yeah, there we go. Did I kill those for no reason? Nah, I killed them for runes. Gonna be the most powerful, powerful soldier that ever existed. Oh God. That was rude as fuck. It goes down, doesn't it? Oh my god. Give me another warp point, please. I saw stuff down there. Yes! Okay. Underground map underneath the underground map. Do I have souls to level?
Okay, I'll be right back, though. <sighs> unfortunately, unfortunately, everything respawned, but... Fortunately, we're not going where things were, so... Magic grease. Let me double check that shield grease we got earlier. Shield grease boosts guarding ability and all damage negation. Coat's left hand armament boosting guarding ability and all forms of damage negation, primarily used on shields. Nice. Shield. Ant's skull plate. Causes poison buildup. Huge head of one of the ant giant ants which inhabit the two underground rivers. Used without modification as a shield. Excels at repelling enemy attacks. Giant ants are venom venomous creatures granting a boost to immunity when wielding this shield. Mm-hmm. 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 Face or mask? Looks like face. I cannot do... Oh, wait. That's not true. I can't move while using the monocular. I mean, the... <laughs> telescope. So I'm not sure that there's going to be a... Monocular only run, you know? First person run. There will be other ways to first person though. Loot on railing. Oh shit. Is this the. Oh, never mind. From Anerlon. Fan Daggers. For fanned out knives and enemies to inflict damage. Hmm. No bleed on these either. A uh, set of five throwing knives bundled together. Concealed weapon cherished by the Raptor Assassins. The thin knives fan out when thrown, dealing damage to the targets. Each knife deals paltry damage, but the wide range makes it suitable for constraining enemies. Did you find any reference to other Souls games? Yes. Everywhere. All over the place. I don't like this shoe. Hold on. I want a lightning one. Shit. 
That was supposed to do better. Didn't mean to do that. Behind! Ow. Oh, I should heal. Whee! Nice. Oh, what? That was an... Nah. Flask back. Ghost Glove Wart Picker's Bell Bearing 2. I think I have two of those to turn in, something like that. Archer Ashes. I have not found a patches yet. I missed a chest in that room. Oh, you mean this? Uh, they, they're, unless, yeah. They're very debatey about the chess visuals in this. Unless you're talking about a hidden chest or something. Should be good. What do these ashes do? Summon archers. We can read. It's pretty obvious at this point. We have so many ashes that do different things. I mean, maybe they do something different, but... Where are they? There you go. Archer ashes... Spirits of archers who belong to the fallen hawks, a band of soldiers that once explored the Eternal City. These are the weird, like, white-fleshed red-eye boys. Their arrows are imbued with cold ghost flame. When the message is somewhat crude. They work well as a squadron, firing a hail of arrows in unison at the sound of a war cry. Range support is, uh, very tempting. Uh-huh. <laughs> If we hadn't gotten it off of the uh, upside down insectoid queen gravity thing, we would have gotten it there. Slimes can still drop on you. Oh, yeah. That wouldn't have been the first time uh, in this playthrough. Uh oh. This game got the drip. Can't wait to see this game randomized. That's going to be a task for sure. Sentient ball is fucked. That's not the first one we've encountered. Mm-hmm.
Night Maiden and Swordstress Puppets. They're the furthest down. Summons Night Maiden and Swordstress Spirits. The sisters, members of a cold-blooded race who wield flowing weapons, became puppets of their own volition. Why not, right? Embrace the puppet lifestyle. Is there a light back there? Oh, this is where the ball was. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, I didn't mean to do that. Let's do that. How long is the game without all the side stuff, you think? Without all the side stuff? 30 hours? Maybe? I don't know. Yeah, the the answer changes a lot depending on many things. First playthrough, speed run, casual playthrough, uh, how good you are. I'm at forty something hours here. Forty three hours, I think, was about last we checked, and um. I mean, three demigods down. If that means anything. Shit. Shit. It's okay, you can stun lock it. I learned this. Forty-three in this run alone. Mm -hmm. Great ghost glove wart. Glove wart slab. I do have a big stick for that ball. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I have. Uh, I'm heading for fifty strength. Forty-six right now. That's the uh, that's the main stat here. 30 vigor and, I don't know, 25 endurance. Something like that. <sighs> what intern designed that enemy? That enemy is amazing. Are you kidding? It was such a what the fuck moment the first time I experienced one of the balls. And then it turns out you can hit it, which is even another what the fuck moment. I think the intern's name was Miyazaki. Hello, Amsho J. How's it going? Uh oh. Ranged battle required ahead. Liar ahead, item ahead. Okay. Miyazaki Jr. So I was doing the dungeon with the big chariot, the one shots you did he kill it. Nope. Not the chariot. I beat the boss in that area though. Okay.
We should be able to upgrade the greatsword further now. Uh... Oh, it's boulder. Oh, okay. It's just a boulder. Okay. Um. Oh, it's got... It's lightning things. Maybe this is how they're going to be like... Finally introduced to you. That... Okay. The balls can be hurt. No? Oh! Bro, does it infino spawn? If you timed shit, and it just kept killing each other, like... Oh god. You could potentially have infinite soul gain here. Nah, you, it would need to be spaced a certain way. Hey, look at this, though. Ah, oh, there it is. Oh! Ha ha ha! Yeah, I feel like that's one way that they teach you that ball can be hurt. I'm sorry, ball. I'm sorry. Behold, don't give up. Bunch of somber smithing stone sevens in here. Oh my. This looks... Um... Now hold the phone. Oh, I didn't even get that tree. That's how we're going across here. Okay, okay, okay. But this isn't even... We still haven't gone down the elevator, remember? Oh shit, but there's definitely gonna be a boulder. There's definitely gonna be a boulder. No boulder. I have found so many larval tears. I just found one. These balls drop larval tears. How many do I have at this point? Nine. Bad idea. Oh, shit. I thought he was going to catch me. I don't know if this is... Oh, that's its front. Hi. Okay, she missed her attack, too. Thanks for the Crimson Flask.
Hey, Dino Raid! Uh oh. Thanks for the raid, Dino! That tier had Lobo strats. It did. It did. Uh, spoiler alert. We're playing Elden Ring. <laughs> Wait. Hey, did I have fun with the rest of the game from so truly knocked out the part with this one? Yes. Did you finish it, Dino? You were already here. Ooh. Not yet? Okay. How far did you get? How many demigods? Yeah, I'm playing it slow, too. I'm going back to followers only shortly. Yeah. And spoilers and stuff. Oh, I'm at the same. Three demigods as well. So we may be in kind of similar progression states. It's nuts, though. So good. Uh, did you find at least... I found, like, five hidden walls, yeah. Illusory walls. Aha! Let's go down to the tree. So, spoiler warning, I'll tell you guys what, where we're at, what we've been doing. This is the Eternal City number two? Oh yeah, the item. Sorry, I got distracted. It's a shield? It's not a shield. Is it a weapon? <clears throat> it was like very... Wasn't it a weapon anything? It's a talisman. No shit. Oops. What? Increases memory slots. Okay, there you go. This legendary talisman is a treasure of Noxtella, the eternal city. The talisman represents the lost black moon. The moon of Noxtella was the guide of countless stars. Golden seed. Yes, our weapon has... Ascended to plus nine by this point. Wonder by how many of it takes up a talisman slot. Mm. Yeah, two makes sense. That's what they had the. That's what the ring and Dark Souls did, right? Two slots. Just making sure we're not missing anything here before we actually take the elevator down. I've definitely got enough for. Uh. Wait. Okay, it was too high to get up. Oh, one second.
Wookie. Hi. What am I not using? Password? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I I <laughs> I tagged everybody on Discord and tweeted and stuff. But if you want to play through Elden Ring, I'm gonna do this as well, actually. No. Oh, there's a multiplayer menu. That's cool. System. Group password? Where the I accept. I uh no, I didn't mean to decline. My mouse. Click. Accept. Okay. Uh, send summon sign. Multiplayer is a different menu. Yeah, but... Oh, it's in the multiplayer menu for the password? Oh, there you go. I see. Settings. Group password... Franker Z. That will prioritize like messages and bloodstains and all this stuff of people in the community and then no no. I think it also helps with summon signs too. What the heck is Franker Z, yeah. I thought about making it something more specific, like just like make the password Lobos Jr. or something like that, but I said fuck it. If anybody's just guessing at the password, they're going to guess what we've used for our slow runs. Maybe, if they're familiar with that. Oh yeah, you can see uh, an indication of whether it was a group passworded message or whatever. All right. Wait, what? Oh. Okay. Waterfall Basin. Let's go downstairs. You filled in Franker Z when you first booted the game. So that was the upper area of this, and then we took an elevator down, and now we're here. So let's see, shall we? Hold on. Four. And I have three. Okay, well, at least I wasn't crazy in thinking I had enough. I haven't seen a vagrant or anything. No idea. Leo. I'm not, I'm not certain, but, well, I haven't seen any weird, like, online mechanics, like, tendency or anything like that. There is a day-night cycle, though, which is pretty cool. I've noticed, I, I haven't noticed a whole lot with the day-night cycle, but I don't think it's something you would notice unless you're really trying for it and looking. I've noticed jellyfish at night sometimes. I noticed, I found a boss. I found two bosses? Two mounted knights? at night and I've heard people mention <clears throat> a death bird what's the ash of war for that sword very little can be actually used on this sword and I actually do not have one applied now Oh, wait, actually, I don't think this one can have an Ash of War. That's right, we put it on the regular Greatsword. Oh, Basilisks, okay. Well, back to this. Basilisk, back to this. Smithing Stone 4. Is this a different way to enter this zone? Oh, God, oh, God. Oh, boy, oh, boy. Maybe I missed a, an exploratory route in the ant cave from before that would lead us here, but I don't think so. I don't think it... Well, it might be curse. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Well, 
We underground and it's red. There's death blight, but I don't know if that's what the basilisks do. I feel like death blight was the flower yellow effect, but I don't know. <clears throat> yep, basilisks made it into another from game, you know. They're they're different though. From what I could tell, the huge eyes are actually their eyes now. As opposed to having smaller hidden eyes. But they just look like E.T. This doesn't scream vampire. I see a, a switch. A switch. Are we going down again? Really? I looked for the eyes, but I couldn't see them at all. I saw what I thought were like little slits, but and maybe those were eyes. Oh, good! Just what this game was missing. Yay! Lake of... Oh! Lake of Rot. Do 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 do. Ha ha ha. Can I horse? I don't think they're gonna let me horse here, are they? So I'm gonna have to actually run around rotted. Oh, a map! Interesting. A new map has been found, Lake of Rot. Look at that. That's nice though. They're like, fuck you, run around in this shit, but at least you're gonna know where you're going. Let's see if I can craft some rot. Uh, cleansing item. Uh. Well. Exceedingly rare to find. I have 19. Is it? It's immunity for rot. So if I were to craft uh, just for immunity, immunizing cured meat. I need more slivers of meat. More. Um. Sure, I'll try. I'll try like three of these. Maps on maps on maps. <clears throat> Okay, let's begin. Oh, well, I guess raising the immunity doesn't help if Aeonian butterfly start to run in the man. I don't care about these butterflies. Maybe I do. Somber 8, nice, which we already had 8 and 9, but that does kind of give us an indication of the level of the area, sort of. Your toes are sizzling. Mm, delicious. What? Nah, guys, why do you live in this shit? Awful. Somerstone 7. Okay, these tick it up much faster. They tick that shit up real fast. Or maybe while you're rotting. It's worse or something. Hi. Golden Rune. Is that a fire to light? Over there? I don't want Aeonian Butterfly. If I need any, I know where to come.
Nice watermelon juice, yeah. <laughs> Try holy. Well. Oh. Oops. Well, I know. Oh. got platforms there where did i start i don't know i need like one i just need to cure the rot right i don't need to buff against it and i found rot cure once it's the boluses boluses crap and i can't craft those right not the ones i need anyway maybe you can find the well i do have two items Oh no, it's not crafties. Was that a dragon? That's a dragonkin, yeah. <laughs> like a giant street shark. This is the second time we've seen this sort of enemy. We fought a version of this before. It was awesome. Oh, here we go. This will raise more. I should have gone right first. Look at this. Get it! Saved. What? <laughs> Oh, yellow is madness, really? Ah, rot grease. Well, this makes more sense for the area then. All right. You wonder if constantly jumping helps? Maybe so. Someone in the wolf pack group defeated the shard bearer. What? The shard bearer? What is that? Is there souls items in this game like for you to have souls we need? Yes, yes, yes. Absolutely. Oh, a demigod. Oh, I see, I see. All right, here, let's see. Nope, it doesn't help, it doesn't help, it doesn't help, it doesn't help, and now I got rot. Up. It's all right. Now I just run around and look for those, right? That makes things easier, kind of. Pillage remains, bitch. Black key bolt. What rotten luck. <laughs> so many somber smithing stone sevens. Uh, okay. I will run back this way. That one we hit, and it led this way. Hi, Leo. <laughs> Leo is being so cuddly right now. Oops. Warming stone. I wonder if warming stones are really good or something. There's the boss. Here's another switch over here. Yeah, it doesn't slow you when you run through it. I looked for the crafting Scarlet Rock here. I cannot. Um, I'm sure you can get the recipe for it. Um, yeah, the boluses are the cure items, but I don't have any. I've used one once. I don't have any, nor do I have the recipe for them. Don't lure me over here, message. I have one more flask. That looks like a boss. Maybe this is a checkpoint. That's got to be a checkpoint.
Shit. It's not a checkpoint. But, it's something. Oh! That's gonna do it, isn't it? That's gonna give me the recipe. I bet. I bet. Which one was it? Nomadic Warriors Cookbook. Oh, no. It's offensive rot stuff. <laughs> 12? Not 22. Rot pot, rot grease, drawstring rot grease. I don't want offensive rot stuff. I need defensive rot stuff. Because if I'm going to fight that boss, I need to not have rot. I mean, I don't need to not have rot, but I need to not have rot. I forgot this gives me more, too. I could also... I'm going to use a, a, a rune, an arc rune. Fuck it. Fuck it. There you go. I have 15. Armor with rot resists very well could be a thing. I haven't looked at that at all. Let's see. It would be immunity. Immunity is what we want. Oh, my, 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 my. The only thing is these have negative effects. Increases damage taken. Increases damage taken. But I think there was better. Like Black Hood. Ah, uh, this is fine. 63 tops it, but like, this is fine. It's also super heavy, Jesus. Uh, immunity talisman? Mm-hmm. see if I have any. 21. Yeah, very slightly better, but no need. And then, 26. Ah, 39 foot soldiers greaves? Fur leggings? Thirty-nine. All right. I mean, we look pretty cool. And then, yeah, um, we don't need poise right now. That's a big bar. Ninety-nine robustness. Now it's robustness. Did something give 99 robustness? Robustness is... Blood loss and frostbite resist. Focus is sleep and madness. Vitality is instant death R reduction. Uh, ch uh, chance. A higher number of lower susceptibility is instant death. Which I don't think I've seen yet. It does feel absurdly fast, yeah. But, if that gives us the edge that we need to cross this gap, you know, without getting rotted, then that's all we need. No problem. No probbies. There's the boss. Let it wear off. Oh, the, ba the basilisk? Oh, so I guess it just increases your resistance bar. Not necessarily, like, whether it procs. That makes more sense. Big bar. Can wear three talismans. Yeah. Um, probably four later. Maybe even five later. That would be cool. Boss will unrot you quick. You thought about speedrunning strats already? It's in the back of my mind as we encounter things in the game, certainly. Oh, dear. I think I beat the Dragonkin first try. Uh, the other one, right? Didn't I? 
So, and I don't remember really the fight, but hopefully he's going to be not too bad. But we'll see. These guys can't get up here. <laughs> How many more seals before Diablo spawns? No, we got to... Sp he spawned right there. It's rot meter. Stop foot. Don't! That's going to cover... Of course not. I'm leaving. <sighs> I hit that switch that brought up these pillars. Oh, there's ground there, I see. If I just had the item to cure rot... So, uh... How y'all doing? Jump attack talisman? I don't know that I have that. I have a jump attack chest piece. I don't think I have a jump attack talisman. I, I don't. Mm -hmm. It's like, looks like dragon fruit juice. Delicious. Yeah, there's a lot of shit in this game. Um, but I intend to play it so much that I know where like all the things are. Nice. Not rotted. I'm gonna keep the dra I'm gonna keep this up in case he like maybe destroys the platforms or knocks us off or something. I haven't found a fap ring, but I have found the surprises ring. Right? Raise attributes but also increase the damage taken. You remember where you got the jump attacks housing has been on you ever since? Yeah, jump attacks are really good. And, uh, Raptor's Black Feathers bo boosts jumps, jump attacks. I'm gonna do that right now. Fuck it. How's the immunity, uh, immunity on it? 57? Oopsies. Compared to 60? That's fine. 99 robustness. Oh, yeah. 99 robustness. Damn. Okay. Here we go. Ow. Fuck, he hits. Hard! Fuck! He's gonna s scrape. Oh, he didn't follow up. I hit hard too, though, bitch. <laughs> He's got a limited move set, it seems. I knew that was coming. You gonna scrape or no? No scrape. He's gotta turn around, slam. Head! Fuck. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. Oh. Shit. That's fine. Oh, Jesus! Oh no, he's doing mad angry attack. Meteor style. Come here, come here, come here. Almost there, almost there.
finish him. <gasps> Fuck. Okay, that's okay. We got this. Yeah. Fifty-eight thousand dragon scale blade. Hold on. I can read stuff while I wait for rot to go down. Dragon scale blade. Seemed like a smaller one. Um. Oh, is it curved? Bloodhound's fame. There it is. Katana! <laughs> Alright. Pretty straightforward. Strength dex. A weapon made by sharpening a gravel stone scale, thought to be the source of ancient dragon immortality, into an unclouded blade. Alas, the dragonkin soldiers never attained immortality and perished as decrepit, pale imitations of their skyborn kin. Unique skill, Ice Lightning Sword. Call down a bolt of Ice Lightning into the blade and bring it down upon a foe. The Ice Lightning effect will persist for a while. Oops. Five hit combo. Charge R2. Nice looking. How long is a while? Okay, there it goes. Nice. Very nice. Never been more excited to be a weeb. There you go. Someone defeated a shard bear. Look at all these. Wolfpack members defeating. Oh, God. That was a lot of bloodstains. Defeating shard bearers. Good job, friends. It's frost lightning. Yeah, what the fuck? Need to get need to get that? Yeah. Alright, let's see here. You know, maybe I don't need to be so careful about the rot anymore. We could just run it and see what's there. But we've been here. Oh my god. We were so careful in getting here. Oh. Fuck it. I'm going to run it. Now that's an even bigger bar. What's our immunity? 500? Oh. Wait. Or is it 149? What? What is the other number? I think it's 500. 500 is the value from, I don't know. At 1000 immunity poison kills you. Oh shit, I mean heals you. All right, I'm running. Oh, I'm almost out of flasks. There's just a bunch of frogs with butterflies. There's this, though. Somber Smithing Stone 6. Don't believe I've hit this one yet. With and without armor? Bridge for later. One more flask. Come on, checkpoint. Whoops.
Well, there's an ulcerated dragon uh, as a non-boss fight. Cool. Uh, we can go back to high immunity. 33 is not bad, though. Oh, 33 was actually my choice. 63, that's the highest immunity. Let me pop this and wait, let it go down. <clears throat> I'll do 21. Clean rot. I guess these pants are best, too. And we've got that. And... Okay. And we've got this. And I wasted my rune. Five thirty six immunity. That's a lot. Yeah, great rune. I am a rot resistant lad. I guess. Okay. Next. Shush. Oh shush. Really wish I had just some boluses. Like, that would just... <sighs> Make everything ten times easier. <laughs> well, faster. Yeah, I can't use a horse here, baby. What's the IRL version of Scarlet Rot? Ew. Let's not. Let's not. <laughs> Dragon Scale Sword. What, 407? Didn't I have 500? Maybe it's because I had buffed. I guess the item ran out or something. River of Slime from Ghostbusters 2? Yeah. Should really reduce the dot as well. Damn it. No, don't bring the others into this. I'm going. Oh, no. Mommy. Close. Rune arc buff ran out. No, that runs out when you die. I've, I, I used it again. I'm currently rune arced, aka embered. Okay, definitely there next. Am I even gonna be able to do the last section? Or maybe there next? That's closer. Then we go there. Yeah, the liver buff probably ran out, but I didn't. I don't think I had it before when I checked and had 500 immunity. Right? I don't know. <clears throat> Is there rot infusion? Well, there's rot resin. Rot resin, so probably? I, it's an open world game, so there's a lot in it, El Campesino, yeah. 100 hours plus if you're doing everything first playthrough. I uh, didn't use a different weapon. I looked it to see if the weapons had, you know, rot resist or whatever, but it doesn't seem that way. The rune arc does different things depending on which uh, great rune you have equipped. Godric's raises all attributes. And, and the rune, great runes will always give you more health as well. Uh, where'd you get Godric's rune? You beat him ages ago. Oh. You may want to go explore Storm 
What's it called? Storm Hail? Castle again? Storm Vale. Storm Vale. There's more to explore there. Is that blood? Uh, it's something that causes rot. Is it blood? Maybe. It's definitely not a fine tomato bisque. At least we can make some progress here. Can I even jump onto that? Oh God, no. Are we screwed? I don't think I can make the run all the way over there. I could jump on here from this level, but not from the rock ground level. Playing DS2? You mean Demon Souls? It's like Demon. I mean, okay, every game has a fucking. I'm just going. I'm probably gonna get rotted. I wouldn't have! I wouldn't have if I just fucking went! Alright. Art. Oh no, it's not lava. It's way- it would be way brighter if it was lava, right? <laughs> Adam Antium, thanks for the gifts. I appreciate you. That's where my corpse is. I thought it was a grace at first. I was like, how did I miss that? There is a, like, staircase here on the left I can take right now. But there better be- Yes! It's right there! God, balls. If I hadn't fallen off last time... Oh, praise it. Chicken noodle soup. Mm. I love both chicken noodle soup and tomato bisque. Those are great. Those are great. At some point, I have to do... Uh, we have to work on... Oh! The Margit tutorial video. Ew! Look at that, man. I need that done by tomorrow. Oof. Yeah, rot is basically toxic. Mm. Yeah, that's. I'm kind of excited too to just rush there on a new character and do it. Um. Yeah. This is fine. Oh. That's quite the lead up we've got there. Okay. <clears> hmm. <throat> hmm. Mm hmm. Hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Centipedes. Oh yeah, yeah. You guys gotta tell me about. I I heard there's an item you can use on Margaret to make it the fight easier as well. Can I do this? Oh. oh okay. <laughs> uh, I've definitely clicked on blood stains and not seen them work several times. Oh, not the shrimp. Oh. No message here.
Yeah, I own stone astrolabe is so specific. Praising over there. I hate the shrimp too, man. Shrimp are the worst. Whoopsies. Oh, you're in the rot, dude? You don't. Who gives you the rat? Oh, look at this. Look at this. Ha 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 ha. Oh, oh shit. Oh shit. Alright, oh, ulcerated son of a bitch. I forgot about that. Help me, 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 help me. Time to run through and pick up all the things. Hey. Ow. Ah! Yeah, but. Yeah, kill all the shrimp, dude. Do it. Hell yeah, brother. <clears throat> oh, yeah. No, 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 no. This is going to be a worse, much worse shrine of a mana if they all do this shit. Hello, scissors. How's it going? Oh, this place is awful. It is the rot capital. That's not what it's called, but it's basically that. Oh my gosh, another one? Dudes! How many farting coffins are we gonna take to new areas? Maybe it goes back somewhere. I'm out of heals. Hey guys. Fan dagger's cool. I'm a fan of those. Smithing stone eight, was it? Nice. What's up here? Real quick. Oh, it's just a chest. I thought it was gonna be a boss. Get it! Oh, is it? Scorpion stinger. Cool. Nice. I have not seen any mimics. Um. I've not seen any mimics. Scorpion's Stinger. Dagger. Dex scale causes Scarlet Rot buildup. Oh, that's like an offhand for PvP or something. Dagger fashioned from a great scorpion's tail glistening with Scarlet Rot. Ceremonial tool used by heretics crafted from the relic of a scaled, sealed outer god. Repeating thrust. Twist to build power. Then unleash a flurry of thrusts. Okay. Mean PvP dagger. This might be the first one without quick step, yeah. Yeah. That's gross for PvP, yeah. <laughs> Just rot, rot all the friends. Grand Cloister. Uh, Sammy. Sammy Soft Hands. Thanks for the prime sub. Appreciate you. Maybe they didn't expect you to make that jump. Well, you don't, you're not slow in the rot uh, hot pocket. It doesn't slow you, which is nice. It's nice. No, I did a jump attack, you bungus. No, 
stop that. Jeez. I'm just gonna go across here. Nice. Hmm. <clears throat> Use it to rot the big dragon on that one fort. Yeah. Yeah, if that works. Bleed, I heard, works really well. Cats. Okay. Another coffin. Is it going to go up or down? It's at a waterfall, so probably down. Definitely down. Ooh, nice, Jared. Stone key placed near starting gray spot. I don't believe so. Oh, shit. This is the, uh... Ibritus area now, huh? Does this water hurt? Bleed water! You can't get out of here. Uh-oh. Bone rest. Not the bone rest. Check around this corner. Cannot horse. I cannot horse here. Can jump the heck on some mushrooms, though. Natural born of the void. There you go. It's like DNA, it's tail. Ow. Ow. Oh. Okay. Okay. Mandibles. Oh, gotta get my flask back. Didn't have that. Oh! 
Okay. Cards. Nice. Get it, get it, get it, mandibles. Didn't that? Oh, died. He's doing the explodey thing again. Okay, he teleports, he reappears, then he grabs. That's bad. Don't get grabbed. Don't get grabbed. Sideways run for beam, but not at close range, apparently. You do it again? Oh, okay. Bad. Oh. That's good. Ah, uh, that's bad. Oh, here he goes. No! Okay, you get a lot of time to see him coming in for the bite. Mm -hmm. What if was on? You just want a hit of it. I'll have some of whatever he's having. I can summon! I can summon here. Shit. The boss room was different from outside. Oh, yeah, yeah. ding -a -ling. What? He didn't do the thing. We're all into that. That's impressive. The star is fucking leaving behind the trail. Nuts. Ow. Yeah, dude. Okay, here we go. You going grab phase two? No, he just left. He left. Demon Prince meteor attack. Oh, why is that zapping?
Cool. Summon did awesome. We upgraded him so much. Shit. Remembrance. Oh, hi. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Kitty's asleep in here. I think I signed over. Nice. I didn't see how much damage Mimic was doing. Carried by summon. Yeah, maybe. Well, it's part of the game. Um, item. Remembrance of the natural born. <clears throat> one second. Where did I get that spirit from? The Eternal City. The first one. The summoning yourself is hardly cheating. That's right. 80k? Still not as much as the freaking Godskin dude. Godskin boy was 90,000 runes. The power of his name say can be a lot. Although this gives you a soul too, so. A malformed star born in the lightless void far away. Once destroyed an eternal city and took away their sky. A falling star of ill omen. And falling star. Did we finally reach an end? To this place? My goodness. Oh, what the fuck? <gasps> Wait. No. Seal! I'm definitely not gonna have the stats to use whatever he has, right? It's all gonna be arcane, probably. Yeah. I was hoping that the seal would be broken now. Maybe I can touch this and then it's like, seal has been broken. A ring of oath. Okay. Let's go see what... Oops. Let's go see what weapons we can get from that. Maybe there's an armor set? <laughs> Bastard stars flail strength dex int flail which deal whoa which deals magic damage having been imbued with power by the remembrance vassal formed of the same many colored star debris that comprise the form of the natural born of the void a unique skill nebula imbue the natural born stars with magic to perform a sweeping strike this attack leaves a dark cloud of stars in its wake that lingers briefly before exploding. It's like a it's like a whole solar system in there. Looks like my second grade diorama. Uh Ash of Colossal Swords. Ash of War waves of darkness. Plunge armament into the ground to release three waves of darkness. Follow up with a strong attack to swing the armament in a sweeping strike. I did, Lineamento, yes. We could duplicate a soul, but this is not a magic build, so I don't really care. Now, I still can't put that on this sword, right?
This sword just cannot have... It cannot have. I did, Zeki, yeah. We're quite a bit past Radon, in fact. So, spoiler warning. No fun allowed. Let's see if we can upgrade our greatsword uh, to, you know, a decent level. Oh, 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 oh. As ever, time and technique have made her stronger. Tis good to see. An imprisoned monster does not deserve an apprentice or a daughter. At times, that's precisely what she feels like to me. I've gone soft. And it isn't easy. Poor Smith Master Hugh. Um, great sword 11, great sword 12, 13. Oh, it's getting there. It's getting there. And you can put, you can put, um, I know, plus 13. You can get to plus 25, apparently. I would be willing to bet this game has New Game Plus, but I'm not certain. Hey, anybody want to hear stories about a giant cosmic wasp? Oh, nobody cares about that here. Not even this guy. He's just going to tell me to just keep going to Altus. All right. Game of Thrones, Game of Thrones sword is fantastic. Yeah. It's almost maxed out, though. Um, okay, now we go all the way back. To... Wait a minute. Yeah. Yeah, I guess so. There was a path up. Nothing left in Rot City. I don't know. Honestly, I don't know. There may have been some things skirting the sidelines, but man, just running around there with all that rot. Here is where I think I have not been yet. But I've been on those platforms in the Rot Lake. The ones I brought up? Oh, you mean the top of that? No, no, you're right. Oh, God. Guys, don't... I like my mounted combat as long as it's not overused, which I don't think it is yet. Um, it's a little, it's a little simpler than I like, but it's fun to do for like dragons and stuff. I'm fine with that. Fine with how it's used here. Um, it's like the best bonfire to farm souls at. Don't you mean runes? Oh shit, 38k. Spend half your time doing mana combat. Yeah, I mean, it makes sense out in the world if you just want to like smash through things. 
I, I just missed too much. Should be enough, right? Yes. I'm going endurance now. It's phenomenal, random viewer. It's it's disgustingly good. It's sc oh. Is it a mermaid? Hello? Is it teleporter? Fia's champion. I don't fear you. Oh my god. Wait, it's me looking. Oh, it's a me looking ass. Yay! Oh fuck. Okay. What else you got? Fia? Uh oh. Uh oh. It's fucking. Oh god, it's Gang Squad! It's Gang Squad! Oh! <laughs> Alright, it's easier, Gang Squad, though. Nice. Okay, I'm okay if they die that quickly. Jemus! Manoni! Get it, get it. Oh, it should have caught. Fia's miss. Not too bad. Not too bad. This would be... Uh, this'll, this'll suck on lighter, not big weapon builds, I feel like. But, maybe not. Maybe not. That was a great enemy. The Champions of Fia. Oh god, I just noticed there is a sideways skull there. Thing. Hey, defeated the Shardbearer. Congratulations. 40k souls, okay. Hey, that was fine. Some people like the PvP style fights. And it was quick, and it's one out of what, 81 fights? So. Now, if half the fights were fights like that, then I would start to be like, okay, okay. Shard Bearer is like the great rune bosses, the demigods. So I guess anytime somebody beats a demigod on the group password, then you do it. If that was 84, maybe it is. Oh, you're level 81. Nice. What am I? 82. Huh, one up to you. Let's see. Are we going to Lanedell? If. Well, where does. It depends on where this ends up. 
We may it may almost be time to go back to Altus, which is exciting. I haven't even seen it from the uh, other side yet. Maybe I should do that first? I don't know. Magic Grease. No, oh, I have not beat this game. 45 hours or whatever in, still no beats. Who? Lever. Where was that boss you just did? Uh, after Radon, you go into the meteorite hole and you'll eventually get there. It's like five areas. You just made it to the capital. All right, I'm gonna go check the elevator, I guess. Oh, base level run is the next run we're doing, so. Should be fun. What was the boss name that you just beat? Uh, Champion of FIA. F-I-A. It was a bunch of them, though. F-I-A. FIA. Capital Outskirts. Oh. Is this Dark Souls 3 music? Oh! Another boss? Fee is missed. Oh, that was the that was a spell I got. Right, 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 right. Let's see if it's not what I expected. Releases a mist of death before caster. Creates a deathly mist, which inflicts death blight. Sorcery can be cast while in motion. Charging enhances range. The sorcery was developed to oppose the round table hold and is effective only against the tarnished. PvP only? Where are we? Oh, look! Oh, wait, Divine Bridge. Never mind. I was saying we were close to there. So many bosses. Wait. <gasps> no! None! This is after the boss fight? Okay. I'm calling an audible. <clears throat> We're going back to Alta's Plateau. There it is. We came up the great lift of Dectus, Dictus. We fought a heckin' awesome dragon who ran away. The pansy. We explored the sage's cave. We ignored the main road path. But now it's time to revisit. I should figure out food, too. Is it possible to do... Actually, what is the trigger for Radon? Do you have to kill Renala? Exploring the Sage's Cave. No, that's the one I was talking about, Goldmane. Ran away and we haven't seen it since. String. 
We didn't find the one-armed girl, uh, next spot, no. I think you're thinking maybe Renala are just a boss in general? But, like, I couldn't... What I thought was the case was that I had to progress Wolfman's questline for the, um, you know, the stars to align. And then Radon being available, but that I don't think is the case because people were like, oh, I did this without that. So, I feel like Renala. Any idea where Wolfman went? I'm right here. <laughs> Kidding, because Lopos. Wolves. Crystal Bud. Hey, there's another spot here. Oh yeah, he would have gone Nokron, huh? I didn't see him at Nokron. Hmm. Did I miss stuff? I mean, clearly I missed stuff. If you can get Wolfman's gear, you should use it. Oh, you better be able to get his gear, man. That sword, too. Ah! Oh, there she is. Ah. We meet again. In truth, it's been smooth sailing for me. The Scarlet Rot has stilled since last we met. As such, I've been able to continue my journey. Though rather vexingly, I realized that if I still had my sword arm, I could have aided you in battle. Now I'm tracing the path Melania took after unleashing the power of the Scarlet Rot during her battle with General Radan in the Caled Wilds. I should like to meet her. This vanished woman. I think she's in the north, mm. in the lands that lie beyond the Erd Tree. Beyond the Erd Tree. Now, I'm tracing she's past it. Okay. Millennia. We've got Millennia. America. What's the... What's the bonfire girl's name? Melina. Jesus. Malaria. Let him win. I want to kill his summon. He can just resummon it, right? Though, maybe. Kill this thing and then kill the bow guy. Shit. Ah! One more hit. going to summon a new one? Or 
Or is he like out of mana and now he's kind of in trouble? I'm just curious. I want. I, want, I wonder about the mechanics of the fight. Probably got another one. Yeah, we'll see. Maybe not. <laughs> Wait. Ow. Nice splash, bro. Ah. I was left. Oh, I was left. Still missed. Wait. I think that's it. I don't think he's got more. <laughs> Poor guy. Oh. Oh. Sorry. Enemy felled. Tibia's summons. Skellies. I don't see those here. Is it a is it a art thing? An ash of war? Instead? A spell? Oh, it's a spell. To be a summon sorcery, summon those who who live in death. Uh, summons a group of loads of loads and let Three skeletons will appear some distance from the caster and attack foes before disappearing. The dead have long been left to wander. What they need is leadership. All right, who's going to be the skeleton president? Human bone shard. You? Okay. Link me your campaign details. Stop it, sirs. Altus Bloom. So you can have a summon spell, an ash summon, and an item summon all at once. And you can summon co-op friends, right? Hey, what is deep in here? Please be a dragon den. Please be that stupid dragon's den. Mount Gelmir. Pokemon run. Oh, summon only run. Oh. I mean. <laughs> I mean, I guess that would w Could work for Radon. Oh, Jesus. Extremely cheese. I am super horny for Lightning Boy. Lightning Dragon Boy. Oh, Volcanic Stone. Dude, I... I think there is still just so much to this game. Ash of War Barrage. I can't even, like, there's too many. Oh, wait, Ash of War this time. Fuck, they said that. <sighs> Barrage. There it is. Grants the Archery skill using a bow held horizontally. That's gangsta style. Ready the, ready the bow, then fire off a rapid succession of shots faster than the eye can see. Like, isn't the volcano another demigod? And there's like, the the dude on the 
cover of the game is a, a man with a lion. Not a game, but like the title stuff. Like in Steam or whatever. Maybe that's Godwin? Don't say anything, by the way. Hey, that's going to give us another Estus flask. Uh, please ban anybody saying anything. I'm just kidding. Don't ban anybody. That's fine. Unless they deserve it. I hear you. I feel I may be overleveled for this section now. There's a fog wall. Swordstone key? Seal those lips, upper and lower. Hefty beast bone, glass shard. Nascent butterfly, hello. Hel hello? No talk? Okay, no talk. <laughs> is Limgrave just a start area? Oh, it is, uh oh. Iframes, iframes, iframes. Limgrave is just the beginning. Limgrave is the tutorial. Hold on. Wait. Uh, where's my lantern? Oh my god, so many items. Where the fuck? I lost. Lantern. Land. There it is. Fuck. Blind. Stop it. Please. This early area in early to mid 60s. Oh. Jesus. All right. You love land. Let's try. Wait. That didn't alter, did it? There we go. Yeah, capeless. Capeless. That's all it is, capeless. If you skipped Limgrave, you need to go back. You don't... Well, I mean, there will be story that forces you to go back, but it's kind of different. But, um... There's a lot of stuff. To do here. As far as story stuff, there's one location you definitely need to go to. You will have to. But outside of well, I'm pretty sure anyways. The stuff after Radon, right? Put your pants back on. I have pants on. See if we can do all oh, medium load for a lot of this shit. I got some uh Barbecue legs now. They will heal me if I get low health. Dude, the dammies. The dammies. Yeah, I think there's stuff that I haven't, I still haven't gotten in the south. Like, there's a lot of empty space. Like, here. There was this. One of these. We did the tree. This? I don't know what this is. I don't know if I did that. Um, we did that. I don't know. I definitely don't... I mean, normally in a regular Souls game, I don't expect to get everything first playthrough. Hardly. Let alone a fucking open world. No! Don't roll, no! Where's my soap? Wait. Actually, poison is fine. I don't care about poison. Just do it. Poison grease! I'm not getting everything first place, you noob. Oh, 
Oh, that's where he fell down. I, was, I wasn't sure, but I needed to double check. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. I don't even have this active. This should counter the poison. Practically. Or literally. Hello. Expect to spend 60 more hours just to get where Lovitz is. He's missed so much. Yeah. I mean, there's a lot of stuff that I missed early that I went back and got too, and there's always opportunity to go back and find more stuff, so. Oi. Doi. If the rat fucks in the woods and no one's around to hear it. Okay. Thank you. A rune arc? Wait, do rats drop rune arc like they drop humanity? Because that could be huge. Unless that's a scripted drop. Wait, you're just doing poison? Well, who cares? I'm already poisoned, silly. I am one of you. Rune Arc is like an Ember from Dark Souls 3, except you also get benefits if you have a great rune equipped. Scarlet Rot Buildup Bolus. Yeah, I'd be down to do the tutorial video on stream, though what I'm going to do on stream is mostly just fighting. Um, recording and fighting without talking, you know. And then once I get a good fight that demonstrates a lot of the uh, different aspects of uh, Margit, then I will take that and then I will record talking over it in post. That's what they want. Is it going to be solo one just to drive the point home? I was thinking about it, but the thing is they're going to post this on social media and they're not... I don't think they want to post, you know, a 10 minute fight success. But they're going to just... They're going to edit it. So they're going to take little bits and pieces and then edit it in a way that makes sense. Um... So that's cool. Give me another rune arc, please. I like how I didn't use any stamina. I'm gonna sneeze. Excuse me. Who is they? Oh, Twitch. Sorry, this is a Twitch thing. So I'm gonna post it on Twitter and like Instagram and stuff. But the the whole point is just to get uh to to help out people who are new to the formula, who are stuck on Margit and just like what the fuck. But also, I guess, for people who want to go there earlier or something. Maybe open up more of the game. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. All right. That was pretty easy. Ew, look at that. Is that a shield? It looks like a ring. Oh, is it a talisman? Is that what the diamond means? Kindred of Rot's Exaltation. It does look like it. There it is. Poisoning or rot in vicinity increases attack power. Too little, too late, my friend. Rot for the Scarlet Goddess. O oh, Scarlet Blossoms, flourish in distant lands and return to us 
the unwanted children. That's an interesting idea. Hey, those guys, me too. That's where we came from, yeah? Yeah. Hmm. Well, you know for a second run. Yeah, I mean, I wonder how good it is. Like, if it's really good, then maybe that's something worth getting. Yeah, they give us a return. Nice. Nice. Want to know where the jump attack talisman is? Sure. Where is it at? Friend ahead. No. No, he's not. Godric's castle rooftops. Right. Nice, nice, nice. That's good. That's super early. I mean... Well... Oh. I wonder how... I mean, jump attacks are really good. I wonder if it's just because I'm using a greatsword? Probably not. They're just really good at... Clo at gap closing. And then they deal extra damage and stagger, so they're nice. Yeah, like, I miss stuff in Godric's castle, and... Most of the YouTube comments are very... Very nice, but then there's the handful that are just like... Man, watching this is like watching a baby seal flop... ...in a pool of... ...ointment... ...that... ...is blind, and also... ...has no penis. And I'm like, oh, okay. Well, I mean, I went back to... Admittedly, it takes me a while to get used to new playstyle stuff like horse and things, but um, it's okay. <laughs> if you're still out there, YouTube, they probably don't watch this far into the playthrough based on that. Ow, mother ass, dude. That was, that's some range. Please don't tell me I'm leaving. There's a map. Am I leaving? I might be leaving. I think I'm leaving. Shit. But there's a map. I'm not leaving. I'm not leaving? I'm not leaving. I didn't leave. How many heckin' castles? Yeah, the entrance looked exactly the same, you know? The, there's gotta be a dragon here. <sighs> Let me turn on AC one sec. Bloody doesn't need food, so... Jersey Mike's is a go. Give me that Jersey Mike's. Give me that Jersey Mike's. Give me that Yeah. Yeah. Uh, wheat bread, okay. Wait a minute. Banana pep. Absolutely. Yeah, this is disgusting. This game is like, what the fuck? Like, <laughs> it's gross. It is gross. How? Please make another selection. <gasps> Wait, my sandwich isn't available. What? 
Oh, is it the wheat bread, maybe? Okay, it was the wheat bread. Well, that's fine. Um, yeah, this is like three Souls games stuck together in a way that makes sense. Who's dying? There must be dudes fighting. The thing is, Dark Souls 1 is open world, right? Just not on this scale. The differences are, now you have a map. The horse is there for fast, faster travel. But Dark Souls 1 is open world, right? It's, yeah. Check map for map. Oh, yeah, yeah. We're headed, oh, no, not straight to it. I think it's up? Maybe not. I'll mark it. By the way, yeah, if you see this on the map, that is a map get location. And that, learning that is, is very awesome. Because then you can uncover... Is it higher or lower? Maybe it's just right over here. But it's like, it's a road leading up to it. So it makes me think that it's above me or below me. I also, I also like how you have infinite stamina when no enemies are close. Come on. This thing uh, wound up being very easy when I fought it before. Hello. I remember because I fought it and I was like, oh, this isn't bad and we killed it. And then people were like, Lobos, you're not two-handing your weapon. And I was like, oh, whoa, this is cool. Oh my god, he's having so much fun, dude. He's dead now. <laughs> Wee! Oh, wait, does this go up? Or does this lead to a road? This is the Iron Throne in sword form. Yes. Yes, it is. That is exactly what it is, in fact. So we're going the complete opposite direction here. But look, it goes up! I don't know. Maybe we take an elevator up, and then we go higher. Uh, I definitely don't want to know about secrets yet. The the time at which I, all the flood gates will be open for game details is oh, either right before or right after I have beaten it. When I go, all right, show me all the things I missed, like all the bosses. I want to make sure I fight all those bosses. And maybe I can't reach all of them because quest lines or some shit. But, you know. Ooh, nice. They gave me my flasks backy. All right, let's see what's in the jelly land. Anything? This? How many of those do I have now? Oh, wait, not keys. Oh, I guess they are keys. Yeah, they are keys. They are literally keys is what they are, but... 12 again. We're back up to a dozen. So we're missing a lot of stone sword key doors. You're standing before the final boss, would you even want to know? Not necessarily. I could probably make a guess, but... Yeah. 
No. Fort laid. Shit, I'm here to get laid, buddy. Oh. Brother. Oh, there! I remember this, dude! What? Oh, Jesus. It's a cup of smoke. Is that a cup of Joe? Prelate's Infernal Crozier. Sea strength. Colossal hammer with the appearance of, appearance of roiling flames. Weapon of the prelates who lead the fire monks. Its heft represents the weight of their guardianship. Sure. The hammer's head is unusually substantial and strong attacks will fling foes into the air. Slam Armin into ground to create a surge of flames, then charge in. Hold to continue the charge. Sure hope there aren't any NPCs over here. It probably uses stamina, but I'm not in combat. So it wouldn't, it doesn't use the stamina, which is funny and cool. Hot stuff coming through. Armorer's Cookbook 7. Giant's Flame Fire Polish. Nice. Nice. Um, I'm going to take a break. I haven't gotten up and like stretched and stuff. So let me do that. I'll get more water and things and then, um, and then we'll continue this. Where do you go after Radon? Do you remember what happens right when you beat the... Radon fight? You know, I, I, it would have been less obvious to me if I didn't have Wolfman explicitly stating kind of what just happened um, at the end of the Radon fight. So I could see, yeah, I could see you just being like, well, now what? <clears throat> but spoilers. Spoilers. The Wolfman tells you that Radon was holding up a meteor or some shit and when he dies he releases it and then it falls to the world and it falls to the world in Limgrave all the stars yeah something like yeah I mean but uh, among all of that stuff there's also a meteor so it falls and it creates a hole somewhere around here and you'll see sh see shards of rock in the sky leading you towards that destination. Um, all that I remembered when watching it, because I didn't think it was like, you know, super important to necessarily catch all the details, all the details. I just saw, uh, you know, a big flash in the sky and whatever. I didn't remember a, a meteor falling and doing all that. So thank you, Wolfman, for... I'm glad that he was there for me. Let me zoop. Ah, oh, no, I said, let me zoop. There we go. Favorite boss fight so far? Shit. Man, I really like that dragon. That we still haven't even beaten. Because I don't know where he is now. But that dragon is fucking awesome. Um, they'll never find me. What? What? Did they say something else before that? Fire Scorpion Charm. I really liked... 
dog of Radigan or wolf. Red wolf. Radigan's red wolf. Whatever it's called. Um, scorpion. Raises fire attack but lowers damage negation. Hehe. <laughs> I'll survive it. I swear it. I'll soon be back at the Volcano Manor. Wait, did he say something else? No, that's it. All right. Uh, suddenly there are shinies. Were those always... I guess those were always there. Slumbering egg. Pardon me? Oh, okay. They said... They said they'll never find me. What? I, I, mean, I didn't see if there was a... A line before that. Is the tree just moving that much because it's windy? Hole. No. Nah. I figure maybe there's some guy either dead on the floor, not dead on the floor, rather, or. Or they were, um. Camouflaged. Huh. Shit. Well, now I'm worried because I think I missed that. Maybe it was just this guy? No. Why would it just be that guy? Okay. Uh, oh, no. Oh, yes. Did I already do this? Yes? Yeah, 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 yeah. That's where I fought the dude. Oh, this was just a side entrance, too. Where we got the hammer. Oh, damn it. Encountered a lot of dev meshes, messages. Not a lot, no. Was it the ghosty guy? I guess so. If so, then good. But I don't know. Hey, guys. Y'all having a nice worship sesh? Cool. They're nice and distracted. These trees are happy. Oh my. Okay. Battle bots! They're fighting each other! Hmm. Ooh. Ah, sacramental bud. Visions of ranged battle. You won't. Jump attack ahead. Screw you. Ah. Uh, Fort Layed. Layed. Fart Layed, man. Um. I feel like I've missed a. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh. Oh yes! Yes! What? Oh wait, I fought this guy in the... Oh shit, I already used this. Hey guy. Alright, Quellag. Come on. Fought him in one of the dungeons. Damn! Jeez. Oh god, don't. I'm not on. Alright. Fuck. Huh. Alright.
Oh yeah. Yep, it was in Gale's... Gale's cave or whatever. No, hit him in the head, bro. Give me big staggies. Big staggies. Come on. Staggies. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. I don't love big staggies, dude. Still first playthrough, correct. There's lava, dude. Watch out. Uh-oh. That looks bad. Oh, he's standing up! Whoa, shit! The other one did not do this. Oh my god. Don't. Uh. Fuck. Ball. Cut the tail. <laughs> ah! One shot! missing so much. Mimic is going nuts, dude. Holy shit. Well, I can't really take advantage of that freaking game. Holy Mimic. Mountain boys! No, you're dead. Bye. Ooh. A new draconic power is available. 